Hey guys, and welcome to another pickups video. And today we have a pretty cool pickups video because what I picked up was from Walmart, you know. So the first thing I picked up was the Sega Genesis Ultimate Portable Gaming Player, which is right here. As you can see it, oh, it's glory. It has a lot of cool features and stuff. And also, I got from PlayStation 2, the Grand Theft Auto Collection. Yep. That's right there, the Grand Theft Auto Collection for PlayStation 2. I never thought that they would sell that, you know. But they actually do still sell PlayStation 2 stuff brand new at Walmart. And this is the trilogy collection that brings all three games. Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, Vice City, and Grand Theft Auto 3. Brand new. Let's get into the unboxing, shall we? Of this pickups video. First, let's unbox the Sega Genesis Ultimate Portable Gaming System. It actually includes all these games, plus, well, in total it's 85 games, but yeah. Let's see. And the first thing you see when you unbox it is wow. This is a big ass manual. Oh, okay, so this manual has instructions for every single game, probably. Alright, put that to the side. You also get the USB charging cable. That's pretty cool. And last but not least, because there's nothing else. It's the actual gaming portable console. So basically you have a an SD card slot right here. Here's where you connect the USB cable. This is AV out. It doesn't come with an AV out cable unfortunately to connect to your TV. But if you find one online, I'm sure you can. You know, you can connect this to your TV and you use this as your controller. And then here you have the volume knob. And then down here you got your headphones jack and the on and off switch is here and this is like a sticker of Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and oh yeah there's the speaker and then over here on the side is so you could connect put a like a strap for your wrist strap and yes it's official it's from Sega Genesis this is the first portable Sega game gear made for stuff for, for games of the Genesis. Anywho, let's keep on moving. Let's move along now with the Grand Theft Auto collection. My surprise that I'm wondering is I hope it comes with the posters just like it used to from back in the days.
Okay, so here you got the game. Oh my god, this, this still has that new game smell. I'm sniffing it, I'm sorry, I gotta do it. It has that new game smell. And I think this is the poster, guys, that I was talking about. Okay, let's move on to the next game. Here's the game, and here's the poster. And of course the poster always has the map on the side, just like part 3 did. I did in Miami. Not to unbox the last one. And well, there's really nothing in there. And there's the big gigantic San Andreas poster. There's the game. But what sucks is it doesn't come with the manuals. Which would have been great. But uh, yeah. Here are all the posters in all its glory. This is everything combined it into one unboxing. You know, just everything. These are my new director's chairs. And well guys, there's one more thing we gotta do. Is break the seal off the off the Sega Genesis handheld.
so this is what it looks like when it's on. Let's try again. Wow, I like the LED on it, LED screen. The sound is a little off. Alright guys, you saw the test. And that was today's YouTube episode of the pickups video that I got on Walmart which I'm still shocked that I found a couple of this PlayStation 2 Grand Theft Auto trilogy at Walmart because they don't sell PS2 games anymore. And also this Sega Genesis mini thing, but uh, console. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching and see you next time.